Hey guys, what's up? And welcome to an unboxing and quick look at the Corsair Dominator Platinum DDR4 memory. Now, at time of filming, you can only get four gigabyte modules of this memory. So this is the 16 gig kit, uh, four four gig modules. Um, I think it's like CL16 rating, 16 uh, 66 meg, uh, 26 66 megahertz. Sorry, um, and this is really the only one I could get. Most of them weren't in stock. So just look around the packaging. But it's a 16 uh, gigabyte DDR4, four times four. Dominator Platinum's there, you see a little window. On the side we have a little metallic logo, Dominator Platinum's, and it follows exactly the same thing. There's a little Corsair Link logo up there to let you know, if you want to, you can wire massive cables all the way up to your RAM um, for Corsair Link. Now I'm just going to um, open this seal very badly, but I don't have a knife on hand, so this has got to be the, this, the way it's got to be. Sorry about that. Okay, so we'll just unbox this memory, take up one side and well, slide out these weird little rubber foamy kind of sockets they have for the RAM. And there you go, we get our two little, oh crap, almost dropped it, two weird little selections of showcased memory. Uh, so we'll, we'll only use one of these because we may as well uh, just pop it out. Uh, here's the stick itself, has a little plastic cover on it. And I've been waiting for Dominator RAM for a long time. Um, I wanted some Dominator Platinums, DDR3, and then, oh, whoops, let me to break the package in. Boop. I wanted some uh, DDR3 Dominator Platinums, but when I was building an X99 system, I was worried they wouldn't even ship DDR4 Dominator Platinums, but of course they did. Okay, so just for a quick look, we can see we have this sort of metal uh, heatsink here with this aluminium uh, bar over the top. We don't get the windows like you can in the customizable, um, the customizable light bars, but you know, it still says Dominator DDR4 and it's made of aluminium, which is great. Uh, under this lip here, there is actually um, LEDs and a light bar to diffuse that. Um, and what this will potentially do is just shine down on your memory slot. It's a very, very dim glow, um, but it actually looks really, really fancy. Um, we see the spec of our memory, roughly, like a short little spec. Uh, 2666 megahertz, so it's pretty standard for DDR4 RAM at the moment. And going on the other side, we see that we're uh, the 16 gig kit, 4x4. Uh, 2666 and uh, class 16 latency, 1.2 volts, 16, uh, 18, 18, 35. Now, okay, so I thought I'd do a little bit of the video on installing the new uh, Dominator Platinum DDR4 RAM uh, into my um, X99 system. Now, this could be pretty clunky given the fact that I've got to do this vertically just so you can be able to see it. Um, but what we'll do is uh, the, the slots are actually configured 1, 2, Three, four. So if we just, um, the bottom slots are, you know, non-openable, but the top slots uh, are. So if we just pop the top slot open, make sure this little notch is lined up with the hole uh, or the little notch inside the dim. Now it's very centered this year, so it's actually hard, or well, this generation, sorry, um, so it's actually hard to guess um, which one is which. But just sort of get them lined up and then push evenly. So you may have heard that little click there. That's one. Uh, platinum, uh, that's one RAM stick, sorry, installed. Uh, secondly, we're going to go again. So we'll just go into the, the next slot that's the same colour. Okay, and with that done, that is the four memory modules installed. Now, X99 boards usually come with 8 DIMM slots, so we'll be able to fit another 16 gigs and upgrade to 32 gigs, or even in the future with 16 gig DIMMs, I think, coming soon. Um, we may even be able to go up to, I think, what is it, 128 gigs in one system with motherboards that support it. So that's going to be it for this video. I know that there wasn't actually much content in this video, but I thought I'd give you a little overlook of my uh, new Dominator Platinum DDR4 memory. If you have any questions about it, anything you want to ask in general about my system, then please feel free to leave it in the comments down below. There will be an updated uh, room tour thing coming soon uh, about my office. It's changed quite a lot, so uh, that will be coming soon. Um, so I'm just going to leave, and there's probably some glamour footage over the top here, um, but I'm just going to leave to play on my new system, which I've not yet played with yet because I've been waiting for this RAM. So thanks for watching, and I'll hopefully see you in the next one.